Hi. Um, some very inspirational material here. Um, it was my birthday yesterday and somebody thought it would be cool to send me this cool magazine called um, Life After 50. Let me tell you, if you're not 50 yet, you don't need to read this thing. And if you're over 50, you definitely should not be reading this thing. Um, that being said, um, the next clip from Ironclad is called uh, The Betrayal. At this point, uh, King John has surrounded Rochester Castle and we're in the process of starving the inhabitants of the castle to death. Um, this actually happened. James Purefoy, who plays the Templar, breaks out of the castle, sneaks into our camp, steals our food, goes back and feeds the people in the castle. Tiberius is actually quite impressed by this, but King John is not. Proceeds to tell Tiberius that he actually sold him down the river to the Pope and that his lands, uh, the Baltic states, Tiberius's lands, are now about to become Christianized. Um, so Tiberius has to make a decision. He realizes that now his fate is entwined with those people inside the castle. And he makes his final move. Here it is, the betrayal. You are relieved of your command, Captain. Get back in your rowboat and go home. I'm not leaving without my men. Oh, yes, you are. And I will tell you why. The Pope has had a change of heart. What do you say? I say that when your pathetic little army arrives back at your houses, you will find your lands Christianized. You did not speak to the Pope of my land? <laughs> why in God's name would I do that? Take this castle, Tiberius. And if you do not, you will be sailing home to quite a different world. <laughs>